G'day Australia, I'm Coram E from Fly On E Zero Emissions Aviation. Today I want to talk to you about how Fly On E is making zero emissions aviation with electric trainer and recreational aircraft like the one charging behind me more accessible to more aviators and new aviators. Not only are the cost of operations of an electric aircraft much lower due to the lower cost of scheduled maintenance and of course the lower cost of fuel, particularly if that fuel, in this case energy, is collected from renewable sources such as our abundant solar access here in Australia. Uh, the, the cost is drastically, drastically reduced to operate. Now we are further making the aircraft more accessible to new and existing aviators by syndicating the ownership of these aircraft. So by syndicating the ownership, it lowers the cost of acquisition. The aircraft behind me is a beautiful carbon composite frame. There's a lot of brand new technology in there. Uh, it's a quarter of a million dollar aircraft. And that's a high barrier to entry for a lot of recreational aviators. So by syndicating the ownership, we achieve a few things. We lower the cost of acquisition, but we also achieve returns on investment for the syndicate members. So we've got a few levels of syndicate members that are joining the syndicate. The aircraft behind me is syndicated. Uh, I only own about 35% of this aircraft and other investors have joined to own this aircraft as well. Now this aircraft is positively geared as a functioning business asset and will generate a return. Some of the entry level syndicate members coming in at around the 5k mark have just joined to get a passive return on investment carved off some of their investment portfolio or some of their savings to invest in this aircraft and due to the operations that it runs in the flight school and the recreational hire it generates an income and that income exceeds its maintenance expenses. Now that generates a passive return for the syndicate members. Some syndicate members as I mentioned are just passive investors that want to see a little return on a small investment and most of those investors are coming in around about the five or ten thousand dollar mark. Then we have another few syndicate members that have taken a bigger acquisition in the aircraft. The reason they've done this is because our syndicate members that are investing over ten or over twenty thousand dollars are in different classes of membership that gives them access to the plane to fly recreationally at a lower cost than the general retail recreational aviation higher price of this plane. So for someone that wants to fly fairly frequently, maybe once a month, maybe twice a month, they might send but buy into a syndicate and part own the aircraft to lower their cost of operations for themselves to hire the aircraft per hour at a reduced rate. We've got pricing information on the website on the aircraft ownership tab. Visit www.flyone.com.au, links below to find out more about that. Now these aircraft syndicate members get lower cost of access to the aircraft for their own recreational flying and they still get a return on their investment. So their investment is not uh, simply to pay for their hobby. It's in fact giving them a passive return because this aircraft, when they're not flying it, is working. It's working in the flight school as a trainer and it's being hired out recreationally to other people that are not in the syndicate. So people that have done their endorsement to fly this aircraft, other aviators, we've got uh, people with CPLs, PPLs, uh, RPLs, have done their endorsement to fly this RAOS registered aircraft and then they hire it per hour to fly recreationally. We've got a growing network of charge nodes in Western Australia where you can fly this aircraft from Jandicott to Murrayfield. We're looking at charge nodes in Bunbury and uh, Preston Field, uh, Preston, Preston Beach. And uh, there's quite a large map of growing intended sites, including Rottnest Island as well. Uh, there's a few more coming along down the line as we expand this network. Check out the website again and the Lilypad Elevate page of the website to see our growing network map of, map of proposed and established sites where you can fly this aircraft, recharge and then return home. All zero emissions and all pay per hour. You only pay for the time you're in the sky. So by syndicating the ownership of this, we've massively lowered the cost of acquisition. We've opened up a, a variety of opportunities for micro-investors that don't fly the plane, that want a passive return, and for recreational aviators that do fly the plane, that want to lower their cost of use for recreational aviation and get a passive return on their investment. By doing this, we hope to reach more new and existing aviators and convert them to electric flight. The flight experience in electric is very hard to explain how magnificent it is. It's so much more peaceful. There's no chassis vibration. The noise is massively reduced. It's a brand new aircraft, so it feels excellent. Everything is sharp and new and shiny. And it's absolutely fantastic to fly. You have to experience it. Make sure you hit the links below to find out more and check out 
all of our activity on the socials. You'll see lots of uh, videos and lots of stills of this aircraft in action. And we'd love to see you get involved, throw your comments, give some context to other users. If you've flown electric, please comment below or comment on our socials and uh, give us some feedback on your experience of flying electric, either in our aircraft or other electric aircraft out there. And if you are interested in investing in the electric aviation future, please do so. Please get involved in one of our syndicates. We've got two more aircraft ordered and on the way that we're syndicating the ownership of, and this aircraft will also operate in flight schools and be available for recreational hire to earn money, to repay the syndicate, and to make an aircraft more accessible to more people at a lower cost than ever before. Similarly, we've brought down the cost of flight training as well in our Sky Academy Flight Training School partners. We've by giving them access to these electric aircraft, it's lowered their cost of operations, which has been able to keep the cost of flight training much lower than ever before and make it, again, more accessible for more people. As we move on from these two-seater light sport aircraft and into larger aircraft in the future, we'll have access to longer range, up to 750 kilometers. We're looking at payloads of four or five hundred kilos, uh, so four or five seater aircraft will be available, all electric, all zero emissions. These are some of the amazing things we have coming up in the coming years. These aircraft will often be syndicated as well, so there's going to be more syndicate opportunities in the future as we get into commercial operations when more aircraft become available. But we've got opportunities for you to make a passive income now in the emerging zero emissions aviation industry uh, and marketplace. Uh, we're paving the way. We're hoping you can get involved. Thank you so much for watching. I uh, hope you've learned something and please throw your comments below. If you've got any questions, hit us up. Love to answer them. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. We want to see you again here soon and we want to keep you up to date on how Fly On E is changing aviation and how we are making more opportunities open to more aviators, new and existing, with zero emissions electric aircraft.